Howdy folks and good morning. Oh dear. You all remember Mighty Mouse, my beautiful 1985 Daihatsu charade. Well, sad to say she's been neglected. Yes, my poor Mighty Mouse. So I've uh, bought a new battery from Kenzone and I've come over because this old battery, even though it's from 2021, you can see I even signed my batteries, it's dead. And poor Mighty Mouse has just been sitting here and uh, not moving for the longest time. Yes, I've got impromptu uh, foliage. Very pretty actually. Wildflower from anywhere I'm getting sidetracked. Poor little Mighty Mouse. She is very dirty. And I don't know if she's gonna start or not. But I've got a new battery in. Positive, negative, grounding cable. So don't forget this car is just a little three cylinder, less than one liter, 990 something cc. But uh, Mighty Mouse is always, oh yes, I left, I left the windows a little bit cracked because uh, they want humidity to build up inside and cause uh, mold. So if you're parked underneath a shade, it's okay to leave the uh, windows down a little bit. The only thing is you might get chichaks going inside and making nests and laying eggs and stuff. Oh dear, I think a cat pissed on it. But here we go. Are you gonna start, little Mighty Mouse? Oh, it's been a while, but uh, yes, I have an interior light. A uh, few pumps on the accelerator. Uh, choke. Fingers crossed. We have lights. Come on, Mighty Mouse. Oh, it's been a while. It's been a long time. Choke. Come on, Mighty Mouse. You can do it. You can do it. I don't want to overheat the starter motor. Starter motor is healthy, cranking. Come on, Mighty Mouse. <laughs> I didn't even check the gear was free, but yeah, it's free. Oh, poor little Mighty Mouse. Uh, it's been... Uh, well, the road tax died in September of last year. So it has definitely been a while. Come on, Mighty Mouse. You can do this. Ooh, she's not happy. She's not happy, folks. I've got lights. I've got lights. I've got horn, but she does not want to start. I think, uh, well, you know, these old carburetor cars, the uh, the fuel must have just like gone all the way back into the fuel tank. So a lot of pumping required. Come on, baby, you can do it. You can do it. I'm just gonna let her rest for a little while because I really do want to overheat the starter motor. But uh, she's cranking. Just the the fuel, the fuel has gone completely, completely away. Yeah. Well, nope, folks. I don't think she's gonna start. So general rule of thumb: when you're gonna leave a car for a long time, make sure the handbrake's off. You don't want the rear drums or this to lock. Uh, put a brick underneath the uh, the tire so it doesn't roll away. But yeah, for older cars, I don't think leaving them for a year is going to do very good uh, for their longevity in terms of starting up and rolling off again. But, uh, <clears throat> you know what? I'm confident she's going to start sooner or later. I am. I really am, actually. This car is just still amazing. But there's no fuel going in, so maybe my AC pump is dead or, or something like that. But anyway, stay tuned because Mighty Mouse shall live again. Shall I show you the car from the outside again? Yeah, let's see the car from the outside again. Still a really, really good car. Yeah, that's the brick I used under the tire because I didn't engage the handbrake. But yeah, okay, Mighty Mouse, so nice try, but uh, not today, I guess. So it looks like I'm gonna have to get a 
a tow truck or maybe get Ken to come over and uh, squirt some fuel directly into the carburetor and that helps but uh, yeah I don't think she's oh well valiant effort valiant effort I had to charade and I'm sorry I kept you idle for so long that's totally my fault totally my fault okay stay tuned Mighty Mouse's res resurrection will continue Bye.